Hey guys and welcome back to another video on the Road Builder YouTube channel. Today we're back in our huge map build with the Cinity Asset Pack free for anyone who wants to, uh, you know, start building and maybe doesn't exactly know what they're doing yet. You can get these massive asset packs in the toolbox absolutely for free. All you gotta do is go up to home, toolbox, and type in Cinity just like this, a boom, and there's a bunch of asset packs that will help you out. Anyways. Episode number two of this massive build and I have a feeling we're gonna need to make some connecting back roads So they won't be main roads like this. They will be uh, oh god I don't think we have the road pack. There it is. It's over here uh, So they will be smaller back roads and I'm not exactly sure how we're gonna do it yet But I know it's gonna get done. So we're gonna grab this one right here as you can see it's a smaller road and uh Right now, we're kind of running this, but doubled. So we're going to take this. We are going to need that. We'll move it right over here. And then we're going to need... Should we have sidewalk on the back road? I guess we could. Let's do the sidewalk with the yellow lines. We may need a curve. And we'll take that one as well. So I'll just copy these and bring them over here. And as you can see, these roads will be like half, exactly half, honestly, of what we're working on now but cars will still fit a okay. So these are like highway roads and then these are like normal back roads. Now I'm not exactly sure how we wanna place all these roads just yet. So I will need just a minute to kind of think of a good idea and a good uh, placement for them, but we'll definitely figure it out. And we're just gonna need some kind of back roads. I don't know where or how, but uh, yeah, let's do it. Yo, so I've run into a bit of an issue. Uh, I've made my first We'll call it a back road, and uh, look, these don't line up, and then if I wanted to, I could delete this and use a, uh, a rounded corner like this, alright, and then we run into the issue of having this gap here of the ground, which I can easily fix by just getting, you know, another piece of this and putting it under, but on the other side of this is the turn. Uh, and this is all one piece, so I can't, I can't do it to this side, which, uh, yeah, it's, it's not my greatest look here. So, I'm thinking if I just, I can delete this and move all of this over one, I think that's actually gonna be my best bet. And then I'll just have to find out how to, like, kind of fill in the gap. So grab all of this, move it over one of these, like, city tiles. There we go. And then we're gonna need one of these tiles right actually that's gonna be a rounded one so this and this all right something like that works and then i'll just have to figure out how to fill in the little gap all right i think we're back on track guys i think we're back on track all right so first things first i was gonna just make a bunch of back roads and then i figured out eh nah let's uh let's not do that so i have a couple i've got one here and i decided to kind of use their uh i guess stickers you could say to fill in the cracks here First off, because it adds character. Second off, because I think it's awesome. And that's it. There's also like these. Like, they're so cool how they just fit seamlessly in this pack. It's just such a really sick pack. Anyways, I've been working on a parking lot type thing over here. Uh, I shouldn't have a road there. I should use this. Uh, now, I did color match the best I could. Since they're using like textured meshes in the pack. Uh, and all I have is Roblox materials. So, I mean, it's not perfect, but if you're out here, I mean, it looks pretty close. Definitely looks pretty close. Now, this here is going to be a big parking lot because we genuinely need that. There's so many businesses and skyscraper, like, right here. Storage units, everything in that center town spot. So, I definitely want to add in a big parking lot. And I've been trying to find a way to, like, design it because, uh... Yeah, I just wanted it to fit in, so I have it kind of curled like this. I don't really know what to call this, but a little island and then another one here. And uh, I think it's actually pretty sick, so let me go bring this to about here, just so it empties out. I'm not sure what this will be. I'm thinking like a dirt road back onto the main road. I don't know, thought that'd be cool. And then these walls over here, let me get a dummy because I'm gonna need to check the size. I want them to be, this one to be probably about double the height, this one a little bigger, and then this one probably about the height, and I wanna put graffiti on them. Just something else that's gonna add. Okay, yeah, so these these are definitely pretty big. They're all a little bit bigger than I wanted them to be, but uh, I guess I can I can kind of shrink just, just a little bit on each of them. 
I don't think there's gonna be like too much room for graffiti if I go too much smaller than that. So let's delete the dummy and I gotta find some graffiti. All right guys, so the uh, the little driveway or parkway, whatever you wanna call it, parking lot is done. I thought about a dirt road connecting here to here and then I was like, uh, no, this has to be a big city map. So you should probably start including more buildings. So we have this like, big complex type building i just built it out of like a bunch of random parts um that were over there so we have round and square i thought it would add a cool little uh cool little vibe to it and uh we have a little bit of graffiti out here definitely need to uh you know move some of this stuff around and all that good stuff i don't know if this is like the final uh you know graffiti probably not i just got it out of the toolbox because at first i was gonna grab some images on google and i quickly realized it's hard to find some that's appropriate for roblox so uh yeah for now we got toolbox graffiti in this parking lot but dudes this is actually what is this we got a steering wheel from one of the cars huh <laughs> but this is actually turning out really really cool I think I want to add, like, I would love to add trees on the sidewalks, but that doesn't really make sense. So I need to think of something. I'm just out here kind of thinking what I can add for this episode. What's going to make this look awesome? So we definitely have this kind of a screenshot vibe right here for what we've done today. I'm thinking, okay, we could definitely add cars in the parking lot. So let's not go with, uh, or we could do one cop car cool we'll put that over there nice uh a few normal cars definitely these guys no taxis i think that's kind of strange i also think it's weird like why is every car blue i wonder if i could change those colors let me see of course not you, of course you can't change the colors they're just all blue which is like kind of uh just weird now that i'm like looking at it there's no variation any more cars like just hiding from us over here by any chance at all all right, fellas, it's it's not looking too hot on the uh, on the cars front there. Ooh, let me get this. There's just so many assets. Like I feel like if I did like 50 videos and did all of them in the same spot of the map. So like for example, if I was here for 50 videos, like I would always still have something that I could add, which is a really cool uh really cool feeling. Definitely got a lot of stuff. Another steering wheel, bro. They just they just kind of appear. There's another one. What what happened? All right, I think we got all the steering wheels. I do hate that there's only blue cars, but uh, I guess we kind of got to just make it work. I'm going to put that one right there. We'll have this uh, this little sporty car right here. I'm trying to make it so they're not like filled in, uh, you know, super evenly. I definitely want uh, a bit of variation here. Ooh, we should do like a squad of cop cars like right near the front door. Like this is a pretty important building. Oh, yeah, we're going to do a three there. And uh, we'll just do the two back on this side right here. All right, so some police cars. Definitely one more of these guys just because it has like a little bit of color on it. And uh, we haven't used this yet. So we'll put that in like right there. All right, guys. So to help match up our new parking lot with the old textured stuff, we're going to go ahead and use some of what I call the stickers in this pack. Well, I guess they're in the road pack over here. But here's the stickers. So... You could put on any of this stuff to just kind of add wear and uh, and tear on the road. And I think I want to run with these two and maybe this one. Maybe this, this, this. I'm grabbing all of it. All right, guys, look. Parking lot before the snap. Yo, after the snap. Okay. Yeah, that definitely uh, kind of fits it in a little bit better with our vibe out here. I am going to take one of these and uh, place it sort of over here just so it's like, I don't know, like helping blend it, I guess. Now, all of this stuff is definitely subject to change and uh, could at any time. I'm not even going to lie to you. But uh, for now, I think it's looking actually pretty all right. And I want to add trees back here. I think that'll help so much. Let's get this huge one because I definitely do like it. Now, later on, I may... Uh, you know, if, if I continue with this map and uh, continue with this series, of course, we are trying to build the whole map with the assets provided, but I genuinely, I'm not too stoked with the, uh, with the trees that have been provided here, okay? Like, it's, ooh, let's add a little hill behind here. 
All right, I'll definitely do that. So I'm not too stoked with the trees that are provided. Like they don't really look that good in my opinion. But uh, yeah, okay. Um, add. All right, guys. So just added a little bit of a hill back here, so we don't have to put the tree as far down. I think that's going to kind of help keep it above that wall a little bit. Now, I did have a little seep through the front, but I think it actually looks really good. Sort of like a rundown uh, vibe, and we have the graffiti behind it as well. So, I'm not mad at it. I genuinely think it turned out pretty sick. I'm going to move this one to like, like over here. There we go. <laughs> now, guys, here is episode two of creating a massive map with free assets all right if you guys are hyped for more episodes like this make sure to like comment and subscribe have a great day why is it always the outro the dogs bark hmm literally watch every one of my videos it's always the outro the dogs bark anyways later